only am I gonna do a DIY, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a fan covers um, for your ceiling fans. So how to change your old ceiling fan into a new ceiling fan. So I'm gonna do that today using uh, dollar foam boards from the Dollar Tree, guys. I'm telling you, it is possible. And I'm gonna do that today. And we're also going to take a trip to Crumble Cookie and try another Crumble Cookie. And I think Journey wants to try, uh, what is it called, Journey? Cinnamon, what? Maple cinnamon. Roll. So, roll. Roll. Yeah. roll. Oh, maple cinnamon roll. That's the one we're gonna try today, guys. I try to give you as many, uh, sorry, crumble cookies as I can. I'm starting to think they all are not good. So, but we're about to see what this one tastes like. The only one that I've liked so far is that one that was the um, apple one. That apple, that apple one was, oh my God, God, it was delicious. They need to keep that one on the menu, just period, because it was that good. So that's what we're doing today, guys. We're gonna go to Crumble Cookie, and then we're gonna go home and do a DIY making ceiling fan covers for your ceiling fan, and you can do it for under $10. All right, guys, so I'm going to head on over to Crumble Cookie. Turn right onto Eva Grange Road. Uh, is that going to be in the video? Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> in 1.5 miles, turn left Sorry, onto Park guys. Manor Boulevard. That is coming in, but I, I need directions. Yeah, I to get everybody to is getting ready for Christmas, guys. How was everybody's Thanksgiving? Happy Thanksgiving, belated Thanksgiving. I meant to come in earlier and say it, but I hope everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving. My Thanksgiving was awesome. And now we're going into Christmas. So guys, I'm gonna be doing a lot of DIYs for Christmas. So I hope you guys check out that video or every video that I make um, for Christmas. So I'm gonna do Vlogmas in December and I'm gonna put out a video every day making things for Christmas. All right, guys, I'm heading on over to Crumble Cookie. You guys come with me, and then I will do my DIY later on uh, today because I saw someone do this, and I'm so, like, excited to try this. And they only use foam boards for a dollar out of the dollar store. And um, I hope it turns out exactly how I think it's going to turn out, and which will probably be awesome, hopefully. So... We're gonna get the foam boards for that project and I'm gonna get that done. And guys, remember, if you're just coming in, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Keep smashing that subscribe button, guys. And when I get to 7K subscribers, remember I am doing a $200 giveaway. So share this channel, keep hitting that subscribe button, and let's give away that $200, guys, before Christmas. That would be awesome to give that away uh, before Christmas. All right, guys. I'm headed to Crumble Cookie, and I will see you guys uh, in my next video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and tell me what you think about the ceiling fan when I get done with it. All right, guys. Peace. See you later. What's up, everybody? You know it's Crumble Cookie time. It is time for another what a um, taster. We're gonna taste this cookie. So another crumble cookie taster guys i told you i was going to give you another taste and uh, which one is this maple cinnamon sugar maple cinnamon roll, roll. oh that don't even smell good let me see oh my <laughs> guys i think we wasted another five dollars because that mm, give me my piece I already know it's I'm gonna be disappointed. Apart. Huh? It's like falling apart. Oh. I told you not to pick this one. All right, guys, let me taste it. Oh, this, it, it, I don't think this is gonna be a good one, so let's taste. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. Let me try one more bite, guys, because. I think this was kind of good. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, it's just falling apart. Like, I 
Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's okay. It's okay. Look, it, it just melt. It's all broke up in my hand. It just melts in your hand. So I'm gonna say it's okay. I don't think I'm gonna try no more five dollar cookies because every time that I get one, I'm like, all right, guys, I'm not gonna eat the shit out of this one. <laughs> Yuckers. It's okay. I'm not gonna buy another one, but um. It wasn't good. Look at it. It's falling apart in my hand. And my daughter put this in my hand. So, guys, that is my last review of Crumble Cookie. I will not be paying $5 for another, another cookie. No more. I'm done with Crumble Cookie. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Crumble Cookie, the fluck out. Peace. Bye, guys. All right, guys. It's time for another DIY. So I am going to make me a new ceiling fan. And I'm just going to cover up the petals. So I went to the dollar store and got these dollar foam boards. And as you can see, they're square. And then I'm going to cut them all into a shape of the fan. And then I am going to put them on my ceiling fan so this is the first step and i'll see you when i get to the second step So guys, as you can see, I am starting to make my pattern on my fan. Um, so I don't want them all to look the same. So I'm giving them all a little like different look. And I am going to start the process of hot gluing each line to give it like some other kind of like 3D effect. And then I'm going to paint over the glue once i put it on here so let me get finished with this last one and then i'll show you guys the glue process on my next step all right guys so as you can see i took my glue gun and i made a pattern and i just like hot glued these dots all over my fan board from my dollar store foam board so now i'm gonna paint them white and then when i get the I will show you guys uh, the finished product. All right, guys. So here is my panel. Uh, one of my blades is going to cover my old um, ceiling fan. So now I painted them and I gave it a little texture. And now I'm going to let them dry. And then I'll be back, guys, when I hang these up on my ceiling fan so that you can see my finished product and it was a diy for under 10 bucks once again guys from the dollar store the dollar store excuse me all right guys this is my finished diy for under ten dollars i'm telling you guys you could do this at home these are dollar foam boards from the dollar tree and hot glue sticks you need hot glue sticks to make the pattern on the leaves and this is how my finished product looks. I'm uh, cleaning the glass that goes over the bulb, so don't mind that. But guys, this is the ceiling fan that I redid over. I think it looks adorable. So guys, try this DIY. And if you like it, leave me a comment down below and tell me what you would like for me to do next. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. I think I did an awesome job. And it was under $10. The foam boards were a dollar. The glue sticks were a dollar. Um, I had white paint left over. And uh, this is what I ended up with. I hope you enjoyed. 
my little ten dollar diy project and i because i was going to get a new fan and i'm like well let me try this and it just came out perfect and i'm loving it like i really really adore it i think it came out absolutely wonderful so i'm going to go ahead and put the glass back up there but uh put a like down there guys let me know if you like it and hit that subscribe button another one of these diys and guys i am done with this project i will see you guys in the next video peace all right guys let me know what you think about my diy project um my dollar foam boards that i used to make me a new ceiling fan don't forget guys let me know how you felt about that um project that i did i think it turned out amazing i hope you guys like it and uh don't forget guys i'll see you in the next video and i will see you guys real soon you guys have a good rest of your night and thanks for watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and uh really let me know what you think about my dollar phone board ceiling fan that i made for under ten dollars all right guys i'll see you in the next video you guys have a nice day and uh i'll see you later peace bye guys